Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Page of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy of someone who's presenting you with a new opportunity. This is someone who's focused on trying to uh, show you that they are a good option, that they, they are a worthy candidate. Um, this person is trying to get your attention. This is someone who is quite trustworthy, uh, someone who's dependable and reliable. So let's see. We have the Ten of Wands in the reverse, Fire Energy, the Seven of Swords in the reverse, Air Energy, and the Six of Swords, Air Energy. So yeah, it looks like someone is really wanting to show you that they're capable of stepping up. They want you to see them as someone whom you can rely on. Um, with the Six of Swords here, yeah, you could have felt like in the connection with this person, things were one-sided at some point and that you were the one was you know, bending over backwards for them. And you may have decided to give up on that. You may have felt burnt out. Uh, there's an energy of you having kind of removed your energy. Um, and this person felt that shift and they do feel like they need to step up. And with the Page of Pentacles, there's then an energy of them offering to do that. And with the Seven of Swords in the reverse, they, they is, it's showing up as them being quite sincere, genuine with this energy. Let's uh, clarify these cards, Scorpio. Okay, we have the Emperor, and this is Aries energy. So the, this is an energy of someone who is looking at you as standing your ground. They're seeing you as being serious. You know, you mean business. You're, you, you're not playing with this person, and they know that they have to step up. So let's see. We have the Four of Pentacles in the reverse, Earth energy, the Hanged Man, Pisces energy, and the Moon, and the Eight of Wands, Fire energy. So... Yeah, it looks like you really have kind of detached or you're coming across as no longer taking action towards the situation or this person and it's triggering them to take action towards you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card, an oracle card for you. Okay, we have what do you need to release waning moon okay we have chemistry there's a strong magnetic attraction here And then we have always joyful. Write it on your heart that every day is the best day of the year. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Scorpio. Okay, we have surrender to silence. In quiet meditation or contemplation, let go and enter the stillness within. Silence can heal and replenish you. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good week, Scorpio. 
Bye, Scorpio.